Hello everyone, thanks for joining me on this session of how to download Elmo to your PC computer. So you're going to go ahead and start off with a simple Google search and I want you to type in the word Elmo download. Um, that's how it's going to possibly appear. You want to go for the first link that you see there. It says software Elmo USA since 1921 and go ahead and click on it and you will see several Elmo downloads that you can actually uh, download. The first one you're going to see is the Elmo Interactive Toolbox, which is probably best for all of our computers if they've been updated since Windows 10. However, our model of most Elmos are a specific one, which is T02. So I'm going to suggest downloading ImageMate 3. Um, as you can see, here is the model number, number that most of our uh, Elmos are in our school. So that's why we're choosing this one and not the interactive toolbox. If you want to use the interactive toolbox, feel free to go ahead and do that. But it's a different platform than what we're used to. So go ahead and click on ImageMate 3. And then you'll see that it's actually a zip folder that's going to be downloading. So let it go ahead and download. I'm just going to pause my video so we don't wait for that download time. All right. So as you can see, my uh, download just finished. So I'm going to go ahead and click on it uh, and it should open in its own zip file. So like a zip file is basically a folder in of itself. I want you to go ahead and click on where it says image made three. And then you have to select which one you are. So if you're a Mac computer, select Mac. If you're a Windows computer, such as my computer, then select Windows. This is just a Windows tutorial for Mac people. I believe it's about the same, but there might be something with the download. So go ahead and click on Windows. And then I want you to go ahead and click on Image Mate Setup. So go ahead and click on that. And then it says the application is compressed in the folder. So I want you to go ahead and say Extract all and then choose a destination so i think downloads is great extract so it's going to be extracting to my actual folder great so now it's in downloads where i want it to be again same thing making sure that it is set up now and give it a second to set up and make sure that when they're asking for um, allowing the app to make changes, select yes, because the changes are using the camera and whatnot. And then of course, select the language and allow it to install. Right. Make sure you go through the install wizard uh, windshield thing or wizard install and then let it install. I'm going to go ahead and pause the video again, the recording, so you don't have to <laughs> deal with the download time was with me. All right. As you can see here, the install was completely finished. So all I'm going to do is click on finish afterwards. All right. So where you want to go next is your actual desktop. Um, as you can see here, I see the image made symbol. It should be familiar to the one that you see at your school. You can go ahead and select on it. I don't have an Elmo installed, so it clearly will say that. But from there, it should be able to be the same thing over about um, getting your Elmo started and using that document camera if you can. This is for a personal computer only. When it comes to the Chromebook, the IP vote will most likely work better since it is an app, um, but the IP vote is basically the same downloads, times, and whatever. All right, I hope this helped you guys a lot. Please let me know if you have any questions at all. Thanks.